Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy M22. Okay, for that we will need the pre-installed file explorer. So if you scroll up like this so that you're in the app drawer, you will find it here at the Samsung folder. So tap on the Samsung folder and this is the app we need named My Files. Okay, first of all, we will have a nice overview here. No? So we have all our images, videos, audios, and so on. But we will need this point here, the internal storage. So first of all, I would recommend to you to uh, transfer at first the uh, pictures and videos you did with the camera because uh, this kind of data takes a lot of storage. So you will find them here at the DCIM folder and here at the camera folder. Okay, here we will have all our pictures and videos in we did with the camera. So long press the picture or video you want to transfer like this and then it is marked. And now you can also select other ones or if it's many then just go here to select them all. Okay, after you have the opportunity to move them or to copy them. Just copy them if you want to have something for the safety, but I would recommend to you to move it because we want to have more space on our internal storage. So go and move. So now go back, go back again, again, so that you're back here in this view and now switch here to the SD card. So. My SD card have already some folders, as you can see, uh, so it's better to organize the SD card a bit. Um, if you don't have any folders, I would recommend, I would really recommend to you to create one. So you can create one here with the three points and uh, here you can create a folder. This is um, highly recommended because uh, if there are thousands of files, uh, you don't have any overview again. Okay. So now select uh, your folder you want to transfer your pictures in. So in my case, I have created already this DCM folder, a camera folder. Okay, and now if you're in the folder, you want to have your pictures and videos in, just go here and move here. And the phone is transferring the files from the internal storage now to the SD card. So I have also some videos there. This is the reason why it takes a few seconds. Uh, uh, absolutely normal, so if you're uh, having a lot of data, you can just put your phone um, to the side and relax a bit. Uh, the same thing uh, you can do also, by the way, also with folders. So you can also mark folders and uh, transfer them as well completely to the SD card. I will show you that um, in the next step and I will show you also something more. Okay, we are soon finished. Okay, let me show you now also something else. Um, let's go back to our main overview, switch to the internal storage again, because same thing you can do also here with folders. So just long press the folder and you can also uh, transfer the complete folder and now move the complete Folder, but please take care that you only take folders which one contains only uh, documents, videos, uh, pictures, music files, and so on. Because um, if you're transferring uh, folders which which one contains uh, operating system data, it's not that good for the phone, as you can imagine, and it will damage the software. Okay, let me show you something else. Because uh, if you're going now to the camera, uh, you can also uh, check where your future pictures and videos are going to uh, with the settings here. And if you scroll down a bit, you will have uh, this point here, storage location. Actually, I have the internal storage here, uh, but I would recommend to you to take now the SD card because then your future pictures and videos goes directly to the SD card and you don't um, have to transfer it all the time to this place. I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me something that would be very helpful for my videos. So thank you so, so much for, and I've created also some other videos if you're interested in, or may just subscribe me if you haven't done it before. Thank you so, so much for your support and uh, yeah, maybe until next time. <laughs> Ciao.